there, this is Randy. We're back from a camping trip, parked in the garage here, but I wanted to show you just how easy it is to install the Reflectix side window covers. And I've got them all the way around the van, except for this window. This is the passenger side, or the passenger door on the driver's side. And each panel is cut exactly to fit the particular window. And then they all have a small hinge at the top. And the hinge is designed to allow you to adjust the ventilation. I've got the window cracked open just a little bit because I also have the vented window shades on the outside. So in combination with the vents here and the, being able to open and close the window on the side, you can control how much air uh, comes in from the outside and you can also control the amount of air that you're allowing to escape from inside the van. But because each one is sized exactly to fit the window, they just press in place and they just hold in place by friction. This one has a small cutout for the plastic on the edge of the window. You just slip it behind there and press it into place around the edge of the window and then you can control the air movement, the ventilation, by how much you allow this to open. That means you can crack the window open when you go to bed, open this all the way when it's still warm out, and then during the night, if you wake up and you're a little cool, just, just tuck in one corner or the other, and uh, you can keep more heat inside, let less air escape. When it's time to leave in the morning, each one just pops off. There are no fasteners, there's no Velcro, there's no other attachments to the window. So they all just pop out. Each panel is a layer of foam, a layer of bubble insulation, and then another layer of, of foil. So two layers of foil trapping this insulating layer to prevent heat from escaping, but also preventing hot sun from heating up the inside of the van. Couldn't be easier. So the Gone Camper package includes seven of these panels for the seven side windows and including the rear hatch window. Again, just push them into place, fit it around the edge of the window, and just tension holds it in place. No fasteners required. Hope that explains how easy it is to install the Reflectix side window panels in the Gone Camper Caravan Package. Thanks a lot. Hi everybody, this is Randy. We're just back from a camp out and it occurred to me that I should show you just how simple it is to install the Reflectix window covering panels in the Caravan Gone Camper Package. This one happens to be the panel for the rear hatch window, but each one is cut exactly to fit the specific window and then they're all labeled. All they do is slip into place. This one actually has a little bump out for this plastic trim piece here. You just slip it behind that plastic The rest of it just holds in place by tension. The panels themselves are foil with a layer of insulating bubble wrap in between. So the foil reflects the sun from the outside. It also keeps all the light inside from being transmitted out. So you both keep heat out and you also keep heat in. Now this one is a solid panel, but the panels on the outside of the uh, side windows, the front driver and the side windows have small vents at the top so you can open and close them to uh, regulate the amount of ventilation. But that's all there is to it. Uh, it completely blocks any light from inside from escaping. In the morning when it's time to go, you just pop it out of place. And you have seven of these that are included in the Gone Camper package. They weigh next to nothing. And I just stick them between the layers of the 
uh, folded mattress and they're ready to go when you need it for the following evening. So that's all it is. Very simple, but very, very effective. Thanks for watching.